Arty, crafty, arty, crafty Thursday. And guess what? St. Patrick's Day. So here is St. Patrick. And here is your binoculars to find the leprechaun in the garden. Okay. Step one, find all the stuff. We found all the stuff. We found the paper plate. We found the card. Step two, staple them together. So this is his hat. Okay, this is step two now. Make sure I get my steps right. Staple it on to a paper plate. If you haven't got a paper plate, make a circle. Remember, everything can be improvised. Improvised, yeah. Okay, step two, all together. Step three, decorate. Okay, so I got two googie eyes. Okay, what color are we gonna? We'll give him, we won't, we can have, we'll give him two yellow eyes. He's a bit of job to save Patrick. Okay, so we're gonna stick two eyes on him. If you can just keep the stuff off. One eye, two eyes. Now guys, I have to go quickly because I started off with quite a few Cheerios and they are going very quickly, not on the plate, but in my mouth. Okay, so we're now doing step three. So we get all of it, so with the eyes on him. We um, got cream paint, flesh color paint, and we're doing his face, all flesh color. You don't have to use flesh color. You have a red face with St. Patrick, you have a green face with St. Patrick. You could have any kind of St. Patrick face one. So we're just going to do this guy all cream. So that's not what you have to give it a tan yet. Okay, so this is him with his cream face. Okay. Right? This is all step three. We've done one, we've done two, now we're three. I got my marker and I wanted to put a blank. got some gold glitter <clears throat> and I put the glitter in the center again if you haven't got glitter it doesn't matter you can use gold paint if you have gold paint use whatever you like so I got a tiny bit of glitter and put this in the center okay then I got pom 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 I'll give him a white one and so St. Patrick has a white nose okay, I'm using my glue gun because the paint is still wet so how far I get with this Pom -pom. Um, for his eyebrows, I got some pipe cleaners. If you haven't got pipe cleaners, you can draw your own. So I cut out two bits of pipe cleaners. One. He's having gold eyebrows. He got them done before St. Patrick's Day. He does have on the clothes. His friend like So we have two eyebrows. So two gold eyebrows. Okay. Now, for his mouth, I did red, but I don't know if the marker is going to go through the paint or not, but I would it. Okay, it's not great, but you have an idea. It's his mouth. I got green paint, and I painted his hat green. Okay, again, he doesn't have to have a green hat, but just, I think the reason we do green in Ireland because it represents they said our green fields, but really our green fields are from all the rain. Okay. Okay, so we do his hat. Green. Okay. Now guys, this is done kind of quickly because I want to make sure I can get to do the binoculars, which are quite easy. So here is. So we just did three steps in this, so it's quite easy to do. Okay. Now I get another brush and I get black paint to do the band on. So like I said, we're not having St. Patrick's Day Parade, but you can go outside with your hat, go look for leprechauns, and have your own St. Patrick's Day Parade in your house. Okay, is this coming to life? Now, I had some shamrock, you might not have these, so I just had this last year. So I'm just gonna decorate some shamrocks around it. I'll just put one in here in the center. Okay, and we'll put it like there. Sure, here's a bomb site. Um, my Cheerios, right? Just do a few. So I got my PVA glue, and I put PVA glue all around the paper plate, all around him to make his beard. And if you like, you can paint the Cheerios red or any color. And if you haven't got Cheerios, you can use cotton wool, whatever like so. This is going to be our St. Patrick's Day plate. So here we go. Three easy steps. Now this was a cinch. First of all, you collect the stuff you need. So you need two toy rolls. If not a kitchen roll and half it. 
You staple the toy roll together. This is step two. I got a hole puncher and I put holes through the two outside of the toy rolls. Okay, if you haven't got a hole puncher, just put it through. I use this thread. If not, you can get, you can use wool, string, whatever. I can find my scissors. So you have your own binoculars and then after St. Patrick's Day, you go look for something else outside in the garden. You might find some bones with your binoculars. So we're going to tight string on both. Remember this is step two where we're putting all the pieces together. Okay. So I hope you have a lovely St. Patrick's Day. Um, it'll be quiet but you've got stuff to do. Did you show your friends across the wall or something in your neighbourhood? So here is your binoculars. So this is all step two, where you put everything together. I got green paint. Now when I do it, I patch like this with my fingers, so it's in there. I get another paint brush. Oh, I have paint already. And uh, again, you don't have your binoculars. Actually, two you could do with the flag. Then white gold. So you paint all the binoculars green. I'm going to do a little bit now. Then when I'm that done and it dried, which takes a while. Okay, I got all different things. So I got pop pops. I got some of these stickers that I had left over, and I got some buttons, and I decorated my binoculars. So here is your leprechaun binoculars, and here is your Cheerio St. Patrick. Guys, don't eat the Cheerios with the blue on. So happy St. Patrick's Day, and talk to you next week.